Welcome to this module on databases. In our bot journeys, we might come across the need to persist the user data and other transactional data. For this purpose, the Yellow AI platform offers the data module. In this module, we can create our own tables and customize them with the fields of our choice. The platform uses the MongoDB to offer database functionalities. Click on Create New Table button at the bottom. Give a name for the table. After giving the name, we can add one or more fields. Let us create a table to store user data by adding fields to store the name, email address, and mobile number. There are various data types that we can choose from. Some common data types that we would have seen before include strings, numbers, and boolean. Apart from these, we also have the option to select an email, list, geographical locations, objects, and responses. Click on Save. We can see that the user table has been created according to the fields we designed. There is a set of actions that can be performed on this table and its data. By clicking on Table Actions, we can add columns. We can truncate the table, or we can drop the entire table. Dropping a table amounts to deleting the table data along with its structure. We can download the entire table data into a file. We can also manually add records to the existing table. Now let us see how we can use such a table in a journey. For demonstration, we are going to use a journey to collect user data, which takes the name, email and phone number from the customer. Once we get these details from the user, we will capture this data and call a database action node in which we can select the type of the database operation to perform. In this case, we want to insert the captured user data into a table. Under the database label, let us select insert in the first drop down and the table name in the second drop down. Under the records label, we find a couple of more drop downs. In the first drop down, we can select the fields in the table for in which we want to insert a value. In the second drop down, enter the variable whose value should be stored in the field. Our database insert operation is configured. We can configure a message saying that the registration is successful if this insert operation is a success. Let us test the bot. On triggering the user registration journey, we will be prompted to enter our details. Once they are entered in valid formats, we get a bot response that the registration was successful. Let us now go to the data module. We will find that the details captured in the bot journey are stored in the table that we had created. The inserted date and updated date columns that are automatically added to the table and the values for the records will also be automatically updated. This is how we can integrate a database operation in our bot journeys. We can integrate other database operations using the database action node. Instead of an insert operation, we can use search to perform a database search or bulk insert to bulk insert records. Thanks for watching.